This perverted old man was peeking at a young girl. Her leg was stabbed by something. No one around. He sucked it out with her mouth. Unfortunately, the man dropped his phone. The girl felt extremely shy. The man was very nervous. He never experienced any love. In his house, there was a secret room. There were many famous paintings in it. In his spare time, he often admired the works of painting geniuses. He wasn't naturally interested in women. One day, he received a phone call from a strange girl. She said her father passed away and left a lot of antiques. She wanted to invite him to appraise prices. They made an appointment to meet. That day, he stood in front of the girl's house. He waited a long time but no one opened the door for him. Suddenly it rained heavily. The old man continued to wait for more than 40 minutes. He felt the girl was fooling him. He was extremely angry and loudly scolded the girl. The girl just said sorry. She had a traffic accident and was in the hospital. So she couldn't see him. Therefore, he sympathized with the girl. He agreed to come to her house once more. A few days later, he went to the girl's house. Her gate was open. The butler welcomed him. He went inside the house, looked at everything around. This was definitely a rich family. There were many valuable antiques in the house. He asked the butler where the girl was. The butler felt very confused. She had a fever yesterday, so she couldn't come here today. He felt angry, so he took an old deer. This was a valuable item. After taking it away, he gave it to this guy immediately. He was an engineer, worked professionally and meticulously. His job was to restore antiques. When he saw the gear, he exclaimed, Oh my god, it's not really simple. This made the old man more curious about the owner of that house. He must meet her once. He called the girl back, If you want me to appraise prices, we have to meet to sign a contract. What if you don't pay me? The girl reluctantly agreed to meet him to sign the contract. This was the third time he went to the girl's house, but the girl still did not appear. She looked for another reason, to refuse to meet him. The old man could not take it anymore phoned the girl to scold. While he was scolding her, he heard a sound. Something was so strange. The man in this house dropped the ladder. Why did that sound appear on the girl's phone call? She was definitely in the house, but she didn't want to see him, even though he had been here three times. Are you kidding me? He hung up. But then, he felt extremely curious why the girl did not want to meet him. He gave the butler some money to find out the cause, but the butler did not know the reason why. The butler had been working here for more than 10 years, but he never met her. She contracted the disease of unable to go out and meet other people. Really? The old man exclaimed. After understanding the problem, he called the girl to apologize for misunderstanding her. He made an appointment with her two days later. At this time, the engineer discovered there was a name on the gear. An engineer of the 18th century. The old man knew this name very well. That is my youth. He was the graduate thesis writer. If you own this deer, you will have a lot of money. The old man laughed softly let me think. A few days later, the old man went to the girl's house for the fourth time. The girl still did not see him. He left the contract by the wall. After he signed, he stuffed it through the doorway to give it to her. He was really curious, he wanted to see. He deliberately looked through the gap in the door. He was amazed and felt strange. The girl opposite was also looking at him. He immediately turned away. He decided to tackle the main task to dispel the embarrassment. The girl took the old man very seriously. Therefore before he left, she asked the butler to give him a key of her house. He could come here whenever he wanted. He suddenly thought, if she like him? He told this story to the engineer. Should I pursue her? The engineer said in surprise, no. You are too old to love her you have to stay calm. He still waited for the girl, but she really didn't care about him anymore. The engineer came up with a stupid idea. He felt insecure. He decided he had to believe in himself. He took the initiative to go to the girl's house. He bought a few daily items to the mansion. He found blood on the floor. He did not know what was going on. The girl said she was not careful, so she got her head hit on the ground. Since no one was at home, she couldn't tell anyone. The old man wanted to kick open the door immediately to take her to the hospital. But he couldn't. He was very curious, so he looked through the gap in the door again. A few days later, the antiques have been assessed. He wanted to say goodbye to the girl. He shut the door vigorously, but he did not go out. He hid behind a statue. He really wanted to see that girl. Not long after, the door of the room opened. It was a very beautiful young girl. She slowly went out. The old man seemed fascinated by her beauty. At last, he knew who that mysterious girl was. It was time for him to get out. He called the girl to let her go back to the room. He quietly left. After a long time, 
the engineer said he was about to finish this robot. But the old man did not care, now he only thought of that girl. On her birthday, he gave her a bouquet of flowers. But she was angry at him for no reason. You are only interested in your own interests. You are a bastard. She said he misjudged the antiques. The old man was also angry and threw the bouquet away. In the evening, the girl apologized to him. She said that, because she was not right, she should not be angry with him. He also forgave the girl, let's talk together. He wanted to see her one more time. He went to the mansion and hid behind the statue. He saw the girl. She injured her leg. She sucked blood out through her mouth. The old man was extremely amazed. He accidentally dropped his phone. The girl was frightened. Quickly ran back to her room. The old man was startled. Quickly ran out of the mansion. He had just left when the phone rang. The girl called him. She said that someone was in her house. The girl wanted him to come to save her. So he returned to the mansion. The girl was extremely scared. He comforted her. Actually that person is me. The girl heard that even more agitated. You are a pervert. Why are you peeking at me? She cursed the old man and chased him away. He was upset. When he was going out, someone called him. Please, don't leave. That person was a girl. He went upstairs again. The girl turned around. This was the first time they had met at such close distance. The old man gently stroked her cheek. He loved this girl very much. After that, they became more and more close. They went shopping and had dinner together. The old man felt the girl was his true love. He decided to propose to the girl. He had prepared a beautiful ring. Just need to go to the mansion. He was surprised that her door was wide open today. He did not see the girl anywhere. She went missing. The old man was extremely worried. The old man, the engineer, and the butler looked for everywhere, but could not find her. The old man did not care about the work, almost forgot the auction. The young man reminded him, her house is so big, there will definitely be a secret room. The old man asked the butler to take him to find. He heard a strange noise in the basement. The old man gently pushed the wall and opened the door. Turns out the girl was here. The two hugged each other tightly. After that, the old man believed in his love more. He decided to take the girl to his house. He shared his treasures. Those were the treasures that he kept all his life. The girl was very surprised. The old man said, if you like, these pictures will be yours later. They hugged each other tightly. The old man decided to spend all his time with his wife, raising children and enjoying life. Today was the last auction in his life. This white-haired old man was his best friend who congratulated him and presented him with a famous painting. The old man happily returned home. But he did not see the girl anymore. He was not surprised because he was used to this. He intended to hang the picture in the secret room before finding her. He entered the password as usual, but there was no picture in the room. He did not know what to do. His secret room was empty. All paintings were disappeared. Only one robot left in the room. The old man took a box under the robot. This was a tape recorder. It kept saying, everything hides an aspect of truth. You unconditionally agree, so I will commemorate you. The old man went to the mansion to find the girl. The gate was locked tightly. Although he called out, no one opened the door for him. The old man was angry and curious. What was happened? He went to the cafe opposite the mansion. There was a tiny man claiming to be a memo machine here. The old man asked if he had seen the girl. I have met her before, he said. If you like that villa, I can sell it to you at a low price. Turns out it was this guy's house. That girl was fake. She had rented that villa for two years. She said she rented a house to making film. Finally, the old man understood everything. He went to the engineer's house, but it was also empty. He returned home. After reviewing the painting his friend gave him, he felt very familiar. This was exactly that girl. He also saw a locator inside the trunk of the car. He understood everything. His friend wanted to take all of his paintings, so he came up with this plan. The engineer and the girl were hired by his friend to trick him. The girl used the beauty's successor. The engineer stimulated his curiosity. The gear was also a fake. This plan was very well prepared. His weakness was discovered. He did not suspect her, but took her to his house. In the end, all of his treasures disappeared. He couldn't believe what happened. He was the best appraiser. He could distinguish real and fake at one glance. But he was blinded by the girl's beauty. True love is overshadowed by deception. This is a great movie about love. The film has many details that make the audience curious, leave many emotions for viewers. 